Take this here fish, give it to Becky to cook for dinner. You the new neighbor? I'm Becky Deffer. Yes, I'm. We're the Tuckers. Been nice having folks next door. It's lonesome here. What are you doing here? I didn't send for you. But I thought Tom... You don't have to think. Get that fish and go back in the house. I think they're real fine. And you get your washing finished. No, sir. It's just like I told you, Tucker. I don't need no extra help. Well, I got Finley and my gal Becky. Too bad about your boy, uh... I know what that is, a sick kid, pretty sorrowful. Put some in, Becky. But I told you before, it's wrong for a man to get too big for his britches. When you got no money, you work for them what's got it. That there's the rule. Why don't you go back to Ruston? Get your six bits a day, some milk for your chap, maybe some doctrine even. About the milk, like you see, I can't rightly spare a drop. Me, I got no milk for myself. It's all for the pigs. Throw the rest in, Becky. Henry, bring the grain. Sam! Sam! Here, take it. It's the job. Thanks, Becky. I can get you some more every once in a while. My daddy won't never see. I'm much obliged, Becky, and I'll take it, because my boy's really bad off. But I'll pay you for it. Becky! Becky, I've seen you. I've seen what you've done. I feel just like breaking somebody's neck today. I'm going to tell you, Pa, you were stealing his milk. I know you was hankering after this fella. I've seen you looking at him before. I'm going to tell you, Pa! Oh, what did you do that for? I ain't never going to speak to you again. If I see you talking to him again, you'll be sorry. Yes, Finley. Don't fret, Becky. You're a good gal, and thanks just the same. 